So it's Friday the 15th and uh, there's no more ice on the lake. Friday the 15th. 15th, not 13th. Oh. <laughs> okay, I see but like, we're up at the boat we and uh, we're going to cut the plastic off and finally get to unveil it. I'm so excited to be able to stand up and walk around on the deck. Are you heading up front now? Can I cut that piece behind you? Okay. Do y'all see that monster spider? Probably not that okay, big. Okay, maybe not even big at all. Gage is pretty sure it was about the size of a baseball when he saw it. Because <laughs> I was unwrapping this, it was scary. I can see the HT. I wonder, AJ says that everything we do takes so long. Poor girl. Well, it's been an extremely long winter, but it's not quite May, so I guess we're lucky there. Um, we bought this thing in November, and it's been it's still been a long winter. For AJ's 40th. Yeah, my 40th birthday. Uh, so, lucky me. Uh, man, I'm so excited to get this off of here, and and finally get this thing cleaned up, and we're thinking next weekend maybe, if we can get it put in the water, we're going to go ahead and get it to Bay City and actually take it out for its first cruise. You know, even though the snow just went away, and... The frost just left. It's still full of very active spiders. <laughs> yes. Spiders <laughs> love boats. I, I do not like spiders, but it's not even phasing me today. I'm able to go ahead and... It's phasing me. I'm screaming and I like spiders. Plastic. So, well, it's good to stand up on it, that's for sure. Um, tomorrow, we're going to be here cleaning it up, so... Um, we'll, we'll get more video. Yeah, we'll do a proper walkthrough tomorrow. in your eyes. What you doing? Trying to figure out how to get the engine to run. Um, part of it is filling up this little uh, strainer here with gas. Mm -hmm. We have a gas engine. But we do have spark now, so that's good. Uh, so I, it isn't full full, so I think we just have some air in here yet. So every time I fill it up I get a little bit further with it. And then it hasn't it been a couple years since it's ran? Yeah, I think it's been two or three years. Actually, I pulled out the spark plugs and they were kind of covered in oil or something. So, looks like he did, you know, put something in there to stop it from rusting. But, it's going to take a little bit to get everything working again. Alright, well, the more we work, the messier the boat seems to get. Yeah, I think this is how that works. Stuff everywhere. Well, first the battery was dead for the starter. So now I've got jumpers going from the house battery to the starter battery. Because it must not have be char part of the charging system. So hopefully this thing holds a charge and didn't destroy it by being cold for however many years. So yeah, all the compartments are blown apart. But it's totally awesome and totally, what's the other words? Um, We're stoked. St <laughs> yeah. And this is awesome. And, and woohoo! Woohoo. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Try again. Well, uh, 
Try putting gas in the cylinders again. Okay. Still going at it. We've been doing this for a while, but Gage there. Gage, say hi. Hi. He pushed the button and it wanted to work. So, I'll try one more thing and maybe we should have Gage push the button. I can push it first. <laughs> yeah? Let's see. maybe three hours right. of putting fuel in the strainer bowl, I'm assuming what it is. Fuel in the strainer, roll it over. Fuel in the strainer, roll it over. You know, check the spark plugs. Just over and over and over for hours. If I could have, I probably would have sprayed something in the carburetor just to see if I could get it to fire, but anyway, all of a sudden, just... <laughs> Fire it up, and that's it. Sure, beautiful. Probably the quietest gas engine I've ever heard. Up to idle, but I want to let it warm up real good before I do that. Pretty crazy. All right, cut it off. So what's going on today? Just racing. Where at? Bulldogs, MX. A lot of people here. No, I don't know. A lot of cars for now, people. Gate. First race of the year. Oh yeah, it went well. Yeah? So tell us what happened. I hit a, well there's like this single and people were, they all landed in the same spot. So it made like a mini, like a double kind of. And I, I landed, I don't know like, if I like got cross -rated. like if I, front tire went to one rut and the back tire went down. When I, I landed, I, back end started going back and forth, I could feel it going 
got crazy and then I felt it like backwards over here and then I just threw me right off the bike and uh, on my way through to hit my uh, pelvis on it. Let's see. Bars. Sorry, the vehicle's moving everyone. Yeah, that looks like it hurt a little bit. So on yeah. a scale of one to 10, how bad was your pain? Now remember 10 is being the worst pain in the world. It felt like a 10 at first, but uh -huh. now it's like a nine. Okay, so what if, what if you had ice cream? What would that take it down to? An eight. With ice cream? I don't know. It's a five. <laughs> Ow. All right, well, at least you got a couple weeks off because we're going sailing next weekend. I can just lay down. You think you'll be on the trampoline by the time we get home? Yeah, yeah hopefully. <laughs> well, this is our first race of the year, so we still have plenty more. This is Brody and Melissa. And $10 well spent, huh? Yeah. Woo! Well, we can start drinking beer early. <laughs> Do you need one right now? Oh wait, you're driving. <laughs>